Not all lies are bad. Just as the truth is not always good. For the sake of peace, I'll be the villain I have to be. Time to end our checking out new new Luna here, guys. While hiding her horns and tail with magic, the half dragon Luna of the Croons is living among humans. Okay. Serving as the royal mage of Prince Ervalon of Castamere. Interesting. With her vast store of mana innate to all dragons, she is adept at casting large scale spells and possesses the ability to skillfully. I don't think I like her. By magic. Let's see if her kit gonna be any good. By using a spell to turn dragons into dark magic stones. Luna put a stop to the endless war plaguing the winds and Karoons, and is celebrated as a hero for restoring peace to the world. However, Luna herself feels the title is ill-fitting. You can learn more about her story in the upcoming Moonlight Theater, Days of Piercing Cold. New Moon Luna is a five-star light elemental mage. She has high health, and can increase her health for the health high health for a maze. So you're gonna help maze moon's judgment using mana dispels all buffs from all enemies before sealing and making them unable to be buffed for two turns. So a debuff at and the start me of the first battle grants skill silence effect and a seal gaster. Skill effect nullifier is a buff that nullifies an effect from skills of enemy heroes and artifacts. Interesting. When 20 soul is consumed, ignores effect resistance. Skill 2, Demon Sealing Spear. Attacks the enemy by thrusting down a spear, decreasing Increasing defense, the defense. Turn, and increasing combat readiness of the caster by 50%. So I wonder if she's going to be... Damage dealt increases proportional to the caster's max Use health. this. A successful attack deals additional damage to all enemies type proportional of. to the caster's max health. Debuffer. Skill 1, Radiant Strike. Attacks the enemy with a spear and increases combat readiness of the caster by up to 20%. Damage she doesn't seem to be much of a damage type mage. Yeah, so she, all her stuff is based off of her health. Make her easy to build, sort of. Power. I think she's gonna want Dark speed and health, maybe. Players will be able to meet New Moon Luna through the Mystic Summon starting July 4th. Thank you. Oh, they show her tail and her horns. That's so cool. That was so cool. I mean, we're not gonna watch the combat demo. Um, that was so cool. A little animation right here at the end, right here. A kind-hearted half dragon. With dark Look at that. Secrets. Players will be able to meet New Moon Luna through the. In the lobby, he just shows the tail and the horn right there. Thank you. Bam. That's so cool. Anyway, guys, that's New Moon Luna. Uh, we can't wait to see her in action. Um. She's gonna be an HP scaling mage. With looks like she had seal on her S3. Let's go back and see her abilities again here. Right here we got Moon's Judgment. It says to spell all buffs from an enemy before sealing and making them unable to be buffed for two turns. At the start of first but at the start of the first battle, grant skill nullifier, and this is gonna nullify skills from enemy heroes. So I guess like if they're already being sealed, I don't know how this gonna work, but seems like a good debuff type of thing to go put on her, and then her most of her damage probably is gonna scale with um, HP. And uh, it's probably gonna be all her damage is gonna be on her demon stealing spear, not demon stealing spear, on her um, S1, her radiant strike. Damage is based off of her health. And as far as her demon stealing spear goes, this deal damage too, but is it based off of her max? It is based off her max health. Yeah, so that's she's gonna be a health scaling mage basically. It's gonna make her uh kind of interesting to build too. And I can see people already uh formulating different builds for her: life steal, um, uh, HP, defense, um, speed. Maybe I don't. I mean, I don't see her being built for speed because she seems kind of. I mean, HP units are usually kind of slow sometimes, but yeah. Uh. Let me see, guys. If you're hyped for her, let me know. Um, 
how hype you are if you're gonna get her and pull her um I'm, I'm probably low on mystics i really haven't looked in a while but anyway guys don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video